Hey everyone, get ready for an incredible journey to the icy wilderness of Antarctica. A massive iceberg roughly the size of Chicago recently broke off the George VI ice shelf, revealing a hidden world beneath the ice. Yes, you heard that right. A previously unknown seabed ecosystem has been uncovered, and it's teeming with life. Scientists from a research vessel were quick to seize this golden opportunity. Using the remotely operated vehicle, they explored this brand new territory. And what they found is nothing short of amazing. Imagine sponges, anemones, hydroids, and even coral thriving 230 meters deep under the ice. It's like uncovering a secret garden, but underwater. So, how do these organisms survive in complete darkness, under an ice shelf that's 150 kilometers thick? Well, it turns out, they rely on ocean currents flowing beneath the ice. No sunlight, no surface nutrients, just the magic of currents bringing life to this deep sea community. What's even more fascinating is that these creatures have likely been there for decades, if not centuries. The size of the sponges, which grow very slowly, hints at an ancient ecosystem that's been hidden from human eyes for a long, long time. This expedition marks the first comprehensive study of a sub-ice shelf environment, and it's no easy feat. Navigating ROVs under thick ice requires acoustics instead of GPS. Talk about a technological challenge, and the excitement doesn't stop there. Researchers also collected samples and sediment cores, hoping to discover potential new species. Imagine finding life forms we've never seen before. In nearby areas where ice shelves had previously disintegrated, they observed rapid colonization by diverse marine life like corals, ice fish, crabs, and even octopuses. Nature's resilience is truly awe-inspiring. This serendipitous discovery reminds us of how much we still have to learn about our planet. So, stay curious and keep exploring. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more mind-blowing science stories. Catch you next time.